Oh, damn. That's pretty big. Mmm. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. It was patch day yesterday. The patch came out uh, late evening yesterday, European time. A couple of new items and actually a change that hasn't been seen in experimental yet, which is the change of um, the military base being moved, which I'll get into in a second. But what we're looking at now is the new Gorka helmet along with the visor, which is based off the real life Maska helmet. So it's a piece of riot gear. My friend, Mr. Septic Falcon has actually got the chance to uh, test this piece of gear against bullets. And uh, a 22 shot from a sporter pretty much kills you in one hit. So it's not bulletproof. <laughs> it's only for melee protection, unfortunately. Does look damn cool, though. Next up, a very small but welcome change. The addition of door sounds. Oh my god. <laughs> you finally tell when somebody's trying to backstab you. Fuck yeah. Along with that, we got a new animation for digging up some worms. Gotta need that one. It's mandatory. Don't know what, what else to say about this one, but... Yes. And the addition of a couple of new melee weapons. What we're looking at right now is a telescopic baton. Which is a little thing you can just slide out, smack somebody over the head with it. Along with that, we have an electric cattle prod. You have to put a battery in it to make this work. And the addition of the stun baton, which is actually a pretty powerful new weapon. As you can see here, I was on the receiving end of one and uh, seemed to work pretty well. Pretty much one hit knocked me out. Here you go. <laughs> and also says, I feel a hot burst of electricity running through my body. So, I don't know, it seems pretty nasty. Along with that, you'll be pleased to hear that the Balaclaws have finally made it to the stable branch. And your best bet of finding one is in the ACT or in the jailhouses. Below it, I got a new update. All the tents, the whole military base that has been abandoned has been uh, moved actually to a new location. As you can see, there's a stable branch right now. Nothing here. There's a new uh, hotfix coming to Beloda next week for stable branch. That should uh, get rid of the barracks on the airfield as well. But all the military tents have been moved to a new location, which are now west of Mishkino. Which is a little town that's close to Green Mountain. As you can see, Sosnovka is also close to Green Mountain. Which is probably the easiest way to access this. As this road, the, which is uh, in Sosnovka, leading up to the west. West of Green Mountain as well. Is, uh, is going to lead up all the way to the military base. So that's the easiest way to get there. That's it for now guys. I hope you find this video even slightly useful. And I'll see you in the next one. Oh, yep. shots. shots. That's not us, yeah? That's not us? No, no, that's I'm not us. I can't move, we've passed it again. One's dead, one's dead. I see the other one. I'm dead. I'm dead. Other one's down. One more. I got three dead, three dead. Who's shooting Mosin? That's you, Falcon? One more, yeah, one more. Okay.